Hello and welcome. In last uh, lesson, we have this type of question in which we have to find out the value of variable by making the base on the same side. Now here we have a question in which there is a value 3 raised to the power 5x plus 2 divided by 9 raised to the power 1 minus x is equals to 27 raised to the power 4x plus 3x divided by 729. In order to solve the, this question, first we make all the base same on both sides. For that, we have done uh, 3 is the power 5x plus 2 and in the denominator, we have 3 square which is equals to 9 raised to the power 1 minus x. Similarly, on the right hand side, we have 3 cube which is equals to 27 raised to the power 4x plus 3x and in the denominator, we have 3 is the power 6. Now, further solving, we will have 3 is the power 5x plus 2 divided by 3 square will be multiplied with the whole expression of 1 minus x. And on the right hand side, we will have q multiplied by whole expression of 4 plus 3x in the power divided by 3 is the power 6. Now, further solving, we will have 3 raised to the power 5x plus 2 divided by 3 raised to the power 2 minus 2x is equals to 3 raised to the power 12 plus 9x divided by 3 raised to the power 6. Now we have, as we know that uh, whenever the base is same, the power subtract. So uh, the expression in the power in denominator will become a in the numerator and subtract it from the power in the present already present here in the numerator. Now our equations become 3 5x plus 2 minus 2 minus 2x is equals to 3 12 x 12 plus 9x minus 6. Now further solving we will have 3 is the power 5x plus 2 minus 2 and as we know minus multiply by minus is equals to plus 2x is equals to 3 to the power 9x plus 6. Now we have finally 3 to the power 7x is equals to 3 to the power 9x plus 6. Now we have the same base. So equating powers on the both sides we have 7x is equals to 9x plus 6. Now further solving we will take the expression uh, containing variable of x on the one side and the constants on the other side. Now we will have 7x minus 9x is equals to 6 which will become minus 2x is equals to 6. Minus 2 is multiplying with the x here. It goes on the other side and divide by the 6. So we will have x is equals to minus 3. Now we have another question in which length of each add of cube is given as 3 raised to the power minus 2 meter. We have to find out the values of the volume of a cube and surface area of a cube. Now here we suppose that the length of h is equals to a. So the volume of cube is the cube of its uh, three sides of the, of the length of the h. So it becomes v is equals to a cube. Now putting value directly in uh, of a we have v is equals to 3 into 10 to the power minus 2 whole cube meter cube. After solving we will have v is equals to 27 into 10 to the power minus 6 meter cube. For surface area we have, will have a formula is equals to 6 and uh, the square of length of h. So it is 6a square here. So further solving we will have 6 multiply by value of a which is 3 into 10 to the power minus 2 whole square meter square. Now after solving we will have an answer 54 into 10 to the power minus 4 meter square. Here is another easy question in which we have to find out the value of speed. Now the distance is given as 2 into 10 to the power minus 1 kilometer. Time is given as 7.5 into 10 to the power minus 3 hours. As we know the formula of speed is speed is equals to distance over time. Now simply putting the value of distance and time we will have 2 into 10 to the power minus 1 kilometer divided by 7.5 into 10 to the power minus 3 hours. 
Now for the solving, we will uh, divide the expression of 2 divide, uh, and 7.5 and we will have 0 0.267. And for the values of power, like 10 into 10 to the power minus 1. Now the 10 to the power minus 3 in the denominator will go in the numerator and then add up as the sign change whenever the value goes upward. So the minus 3 become plus 3 and we will have 10 square. Now uh, 0 0.267 will multiply with the 10 square and will come 26.67 km per hour which is the speed. Now look at another question in which we have to find out the volume of L meter of wire. As we know that the formula of volume is equals to pi r square L. According to the data for this part, we, ha we have to find out the value of V. L is given as 80 meter and R is given as 2 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter. Now putting values directly into the formula, we will have V is equals to pi value is 3.14 as we have already know. R value is given as 2 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter. Whole square is comes from the formula and 80 is the length of the wire, 80 meters. Now, further solving, we will have 3.14 into 4 into 10 to the power minus 6 meter square into 80 meter. Now, uh, the multiplying 3.14 into 4 into 80, we will have 1104.8 into 10 to the power minus 6 meter cube. As we know, when we shift the <coughs> power, which is minus 6 here, uh, so it will be reduced to minus 3 as the point is shifted to the left hand side. Now the answer become V is equal to 1.0048 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter cube. As whenever the uh, y value is in minus the point goes on to the left hand side and the value reduce and when the power is positive the point goes on the right hand side the number of times the power and the value increases so here we have v is equal to 1.0048 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter cube Now look at the second part in which we are given uh, the value of R as 5 into 10 to the power minus 3 meters. We have to find out the value of L. V is given as 8 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter cube. Again putting values in the formula we will have as V is given as 8 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter cube is equal to pi value is 3.14. And the value of R is 5 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter whole square L. Now we have um, by now the value of pi multiplied with the radius and it becomes 78.5 into 10 to the power minus 6 multiplied by L. So the value of 78.5 is multiplying here. So it goes on the other side and divided by 8 into 10 to the power minus 3. Now for the solving we will have 0 0.1091 into 10 to the power minus 3 and the power of 10 in the denominator comes uh, into the numerator and subtracted by the power in the numerator. So minus minus becomes plus so minus 3 plus 6 is equal to 10 to the power 3 meters. Now uh, uh, multiply this uh, 10 to the power 3 into the 0. 10191 and answer becomes 101.91 meters. Now look at the third part in which we are given a data as L is equal to 61 meters, V is equal to 6 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter cube and we have to find out the value of R. Again, putting values into the formula, we have 6 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter cube is equal to 3.14 the value of pi r square multiplied by 61 meters. First, uh, the values on the right hand side will be taken into the left hand side and they are multiplying here. So, they go, uh, are going to divide on the other side. So we will have 6 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter cube divided by 3.14 into 61 meter. Now um, 
m also cancels with each other and we are remain with the values 6 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter square over 191.54 is equals to r square further solving we will have uh, the value 3.132 into 10 to the power 5 minus 5 meter square now taking squares on the both side in order to remove the square from the r we will have r is equals to 0 0.0056 which will become 5.6 into 10 to the power minus 3 meters as we have shifted the point on the right hand side so it become the value become minus in the power and is shifted in the three decimal places so it becomes 10 to the power minus 3. Now final answer is r is equal to 5.6 into 10 to the power minus 3 meters.